Hey guys, Nat Borchers with NDB Real Estate here. I'm excited to show you about my most recent purchase. Uh, it's a $3 million purchase, 28 units, 28 individual two bedroom, one bathroom houses. And this has been a nine month process start to finish just to get to this point in time where we've closed recently. And now we get to go through and we get to rehab these properties. All the properties are vacant, so there's nobody in the properties. We get to go in clean and get them renovated and get them ready to rent out. So there's gonna be uh, this process starting right now. I wanna walk you through that. Uh, the during process, you know, when we're mid rehab and then the final process when we're re ready to rent out and move on and uh, get these things going. So we just closed on these units. Now we're gonna walk through them, right? Pre rehab, show you what they look like beforehand. And I can warn you right now, it is not pretty. So let's go check them out. All right, guys. So here we are in one of the worst conditioned units I think there is. First and foremost, paint. As you can see, we had a family living here. There was quite a few uh, children uh, living in this unit. So you can see a lot of drawings on the on the walls and uh, it's not a pretty color. We got some wallpaper we're gonna have to get rid of. And then of course we've got carpet. Right now we're gonna have to get rid of this carpet and you can't smell anything right now because you're watching this, but it smells pretty bad in this unit. In the kitchen, uh, you can see I've marked things with an X and uh, with a red X. And the reason for doing that is because we're gonna get rid of all these things. And in the bathrooms, We've got all kinds of fun challenges to tackle. This is gonna be a fun process. You've got a lot of these um, dry rot issues back here. So what we're gonna have to do is we're gonna have to pull all this stuff out, uh, demo it, get rid of it, and then replace the wood back here, um, re-drywall, and then we're gonna have to retexture, and then we're gonna have to paint. So let's go to the bedrooms, and I'm gonna talk a little bit about what's going on in here. These are pretty easy fixes as compared to the kitchen and the bathrooms. Obviously, uh, a, lot of, a lot of things going on in the walls here, but this is really easy uh, to take care of with some paint. Um, again, the flooring is gonna get replaced as well, but otherwise, everything functions pretty well in these units. It's really gonna be about the major things. It's, it's the aesthetics, making things look nice, making it look like a home for tenants to come in and enjoy their time here. Now, with this unit, it's the same as most of our rehabs, okay? So we're looking to do some basic things to get this place clean and to get this place safe. Just gonna get rid of all this flooring, put in an LVP luxury vinyl plank, make it look nice. We're gonna have to do a lot of work in here. We are gonna be refinishing these countertops. We're gonna be painting these cabinets. Then we're gonna be moving on to the bathroom. And we're gonna keep that window right there because that looks nice, right? No, I'm just kidding, that's, that's going, obviously. Uh, there are some mold issues in there, so we have to take care of, of those issues. Remediation, very, very important. In here, we are going to get rid of that ugly window, and then we're gonna paint in here. All right, guys, so here we are at the final six houses of the 28 houses that we purchased in probably one of the worst units of these six. And this unit is pretty bad because we got a little bit of settling and foundational issues. As, as I walk across this side of the room, I can feel it sloping, right? Uh, so we have to make, make sure that we fix some of that slope, okay? And then we're gonna have to come in, fill some of these cracks, and just make sure that this house doesn't fall over. That's really important when it comes to safety, right? So as you can see from the exterior of the property to the interior property, it is really important uh, to do these fixes to make the property look nice and make sure the property is safe for a tenant. Here's a quick recap of what we're looking to do when we rehab these properties. Paint, carpet, windows, refinish the countertops, refinish the bathtubs, and then from the safety standpoint, CO2 detectors, smoke alarms, and making sure that our electrical is all up to code. 